Hello there, it's Mick Bikes here. Um, I thought I'd just put this on YouTube just to uh, show people if anybody's interested. Um, what I've made is a, a press ring roller, a pro roller or a whatever you want to call it. Um, what happened, I needed a press. I found that I was ended up doing a few wheel bearings for people. And I normally, or not normally, but um, I'd stuff the hub in the vise and bash it out however I can um, and use various threaded head bolts and things like uh, where are they? all these sorts of bits and pieces and things to put the bearings back in so I thought, thought to myself oh, I'll make a press um, and I've got one of these cheap bar benders that I've never really used um, but they're, they're cheap and they're handy if you need to do a few roll cagey type things or heavy tube bending um, so anyway I thought I used the 12 ton jack and I made myself a press um, which is this part of it and it jacks this down and I can adjust the the height of it so it goes you know quite high and it works perfect just like all the other presses pretty simple stuff um, but anyway I had this ring roller that I made a few years ago um, and I made it really with these and all I really wanted it for was to build me quad bike and I made those using um, a biscuit cutter it's like an angle grinder with a biscuit cutter thing and I stuck it in me in this um, on a turntable stuck it in there on its side turned it around and around with a cordless drill and just sort of cut into it to make that and that's uh, 50 mil um, and that usually it goes on there and this comes back to a, sort of here but I had a system where I had a jack it's the jack I had that on there and it used to just jack down on the bar but I started making other stuff and I found that I need when well, I was doing flat tube if I wanted to do sort of circles and stuff like that it would hit on the jack so I turned it around and I needed to pull down on it. I don't know if you can see that. It's, um, just looks like a jumbled metally thing. But what happens? You jack. I don't know if you can see that. And it brings it down. So um well, why I made the ring roller originally was for this to make me quad bike, and I wanted when I was building the chassis, I wanted something a bit like an Aero Latin because if you've got unequal length tubes, um, it makes it tough. Um, but since making this, uh, I've had to make loads of other things, so I've been using the the roller for other things. So there you go. We roll the press thing, whatever you want to call it. Stuff. And then today, I'm going to be making one of those to do some scroll work. You can see that. Probably can. Got that off YouTube or somewhere. But I'll make a a few of those. What I'll do, I'll make something like that and weld a bar on the end and stick it in a hub so I can turn it round rather than bending it round by hand. I'll put a handle on the back of it and have a bar with a bearing sticking up so I can just swirl it round. Anyway, there you go, me thingy, roller pressy. You guessed it. Why is it time?